Hello guys, it's me again, Sarahs, and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm going to share with you my ideas on how to make kimchi. Don't worry, this is for my son's project. So let's get started! Pagawa ng kimchi, ito ang mga ingredients. Cabbage. Carrots. Radish. White onion. Spring onion. Kuchugaro powder. Fish sauce, garlic, glutinous rice flour, salt, brown sugar, cut the cabbage into half, longitudinal. Cut the upper part, pero hanggang sa gitna lang. Wash the cabbage thoroughly with water. After draining the excess water, put some salt enough to coat the whole cabbage. Set aside for 2 hours. Turn its sides every 30 minutes. While waiting, make the porridge. In 2 cups of water, pour 1 cup of glutinous flour. Mix well. Cook over low flame. Stir constantly to avoid lumps. Cook until sticky. So this is done. Turn off the heat. Gradually add the brown sugar. Then set aside. First 30 minutes. Turn the other side. Make the salting even. Meanwhile, cut the carrots and radish into strips.
the spring onion into smaller bits. Cut the white onion into dice. Peel of garlic. Since blender is not available, we will use the grater. Second 30 minutes. Turn again the other side. Third 30 minutes. Turn the other side. Notice the appearance of the cabbage and the presence of water. Cabbage has shrink, has reduced its size as compared to before it was salted. While waiting for the last 30 minutes, mix the onion garlic into the cooled porridge. Slowly pour in the chili powder into the porridge. Add half cup of the fish sauce. Two hours of salting is over, so it is time to wash the cabbage. Rinse thoroughly with water about three to four times. Drain the excess water. You may cut it into small pieces, same size as that of the carrots and the radish. Then set aside to drain the excess water. Now pour the porridge into the remaining ingredients. Then mix well. Then add the cabbage. Refrigerate for 3 days, after which kimchi is now ready to eat. You may store it in a container to avoid contamination. So this is now the kimchi when stored overnight. So we were going to taste this. It tastes like kimchi. <laughs> so that's it guys. Hope you like my video. And please don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell button for more updates. Thank you for watching. See you on my next video. Bye!